The Belmont Bruins have been highly competitive in this their first season in the Missouri Valley Conference, thanks in large part to the clutch play of senior guard Ben Shepard. Our guy, the voice of the Bruins, Steve Lehman, has more. Gillespie in the lane, lost it, picked up by Shepard. It was a fitting end to Ben Shepard's final Belmont home game. Shepard will go to the line with a one and one. Every time he shoots it, at least I think he's going to make it. So I was, I was excited. It was him taking those shots. Two free throws with 2.5 seconds left. A chance to give Belmont the lead. And he does. To cap a Bruins comeback from 19 points down against Indiana State. Storybook. You know, for Ben to finish his home career that way. Senior night, a lot of memories in the curb, and uh, just fun to do it the way that we did. Those are my last two shots in the curb, and I couldn't have thought any of anything better. The clutch free throws are the latest addition to Shepard's growing resume of big shots, which includes game tying shots against Tennessee Tech last season and Middle Tennessee this season. Pull up three, and he ties it! And the game winner to snap the nation's third longest home court winning streak as Belmont beat Bradley back in January. He takes it and it falls for Shepard. At the end of the game, I definitely want to be able to make an impact for my team. And uh, something about me is that I never get too high or too low. And um, I just feel like I'm confident enough to be able to make that play. Shepard's the biggest reason why Belmont, which was picked sixth preseason, sits third in its first year in the Missouri Valley Conference and in position to clinch a first round bye at the conference tournament next week. Let's just say I'll be happy when I do not have to guard him anywhere in practice. Uh, he's a great player. He's been one of my best friends for the last four years. It's still, he's still stuff that he does that shocks me. And, you know, it's fun to see how he's progressed. We've ridden his back all year long, and that's, that's what's been so impressive. And, uh, you know, as I look at it, is the weight that he's had to carry um, and how he has done so. The six foot six senior from Atlanta has drawn attention from NBA scouts for his all around game. Shepard's averaging more than 19 points per game and ranks among league leaders in 18 other statistical categories, become one of the favorites for the conference's Larry Bird Player of the Year award. I might be a little bit biased, but no, I think I think he's that good. I don't I don't think there's many people in the country who's honestly much better than him or at all. Another way to look at it was would be like if you took one player off of each team, who would be impacted the most? And I would think it would be us if we lost Ben. He's been so steady. Uh, he's been so impactful. Uh, he's done it on both ends of the floor. And you look at his total package, he has been rock solid uh, from beginning to end. No one has hit more big shots, but Shepard says the true storybook ending to his career would come next month. The tournament, uh, March Madness, um, freshman year, it was taken away from us. Uh, we were super excited and haven't gotten that opportunity since then. So, um, yeah, just going out and playing our hardest, and I think if we can get hot, then we have a good chance of making a run in St. Louis.